What's up, guys? In honor of Halloween coming up and also sticking with the theme of my YouTube channel where I tried different online workouts, I feel like it was only appropriate to really combine the two and not only do an 80s workout, but also find the most 80s workout appropriate outfit I could possibly find in my closet. Um, so this is what I'm working with. Let me give you a little outfit breakdown. Okay, we've got the headband. I curled my hair the other night for a Halloween party. So this is day old hair, but it kind of works. You know, it's kind of big. I love that. This is actually a bodysuit that I wear pretty regularly, but I feel like it fits. I wish it was like a bright pink or something so I could really go like all 80s, but this is what I've got. Then I'm just wearing these light blue leggings. I can't remember where they're from. I know I did a video though where I was doing an Instagram activewear ad buying video and I tried these on. These were the brightest color leggings I could find that I feel were the most 80s-esque, if you will. They've got a little like color here on the bottom too. I have some white sneakers, white socks, scrunchy. I feel like I did the best I could on such short notice. And if you think it looks good from the front, I can't imagine going to a workout class with like other people dressed like this. I am so glad activewear has just gone in the direction that it has gone because I could not take myself seriously. Walking into a gym like this. Anyways, let's get into the workout. This is Kathy Smith fat burning workout from 1988. I honestly have no idea what I'm about to get myself into. I love the graphics, killing it. Well, I'm happy to say that I've got a workout that's specifically designed to burn fat. It's low and slow. That means you'll be working at the lower end of your target heart rate. And at slower pace. Interesting. It's so funny because now people do like HIIT workouts to like burn fat. Barely taps into your fat stores. You see, when the body starts moving, this graphic of fat burning. All that great figure shaping while standing, dancing, and of course, burning fat. Okay, wait. I have a comment. I think it's really interesting how in the 80s and like the 90s with like the intense diet culture and like being really thin and like sculpted and like she's using all these like this terminology to indicate like getting as thin as possible and like fat burning and like all these buzzwords when I feel like now fitness and like working out is like how can we get you strong? How can we get you as healthy as possible? How we, can we get you to have like longevity in your life and like your well-being? I feel like it's so much better now that we've dropped a lot of buzzwords. I feel like there's still work to be done, but I feel like it's nice that not every single workout is like how to burn fat, how to like lose your muffin top. Like it's so funny just like hearing the difference in this kind of workout versus ones that are like on YouTube now about like just getting stronger or building muscle or whatever. Such a difference. It's crazy. You can get great results. So I wonder if she's gonna do like targeted muscle groups. Yeah, like you can lose fat in your thighs you when you can't spot and reduce, you know? Okay, are you ready to burn it up? Yes, Kathy let's baby, go. let's go. Yeah, Once you meet some friends of mine, we have Adina and Nancy here. It's and so awkward. And you guys ready to the burn one token fat? guy? Yes. We gotta love. start with a warm up though. So here we go, let's get moving. Feet shoulder width apart. Okay. Start all up. up. Deep breath. breath. Fill those lungs. Exhale up. Three now again. Inhale up. Fill it up. Place your fingers on your abdominals and feel them expand as you inhale, filling up your lungs. I kind of like that. Okay, the graphics are kind of killing it. Like the body track, telling you how to breathe in the diaphragm. We love. We shake it to the side. Shake it one, two, three, up. Down, 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 and up. You got it. Let's start nice and easy. I'm side to side. dying. Side. Another set. I'm actually dying. That. And now bigger arms. Take them out. Nice and wide. Reach with those arms. Straight arms. Another set. Reach. Body. Last two. Circle the arms around. Another set of eight. One. Two. Okay, Kathy. Go off, queen. That guy is killing it in the back. Press the arm down. Take it down. 
You're really getting that arm range of motion. To drop the knees a little bit more. Take it down, up, down, up, down, up. Don't let the knees extend beyond the toes. Folders, take it side. Oh. Two, Ooh. three, okay. four. Really stretch <laughs> out that back. Just hold. Stretch it out. Good stretch. And bring a move. Bat that elbow. You got it. Now a straight arm back. And circle. Really stretch that shoulder back. Just I can't imagine seven. actually working out in an outfit like this all the time. I literally feel like I'm wearing a diaper right now. Six, seven, and march. March it out. I'm just, I love the one token man in the back. I'm just gonna forward seven, eight, go, two, three, and touch back. And back. Go forward. Take it forward. Here we go. One, two, three, touch back. Now side to side. Side. Forward again. Go. One, two, three. I don't know what this move is. Don't take it so low. Just keep a slight bend in the Why the hands? Why this? Just an explode. Oh, she's so full of energy. This video is going to be me making fun of it the whole time, but I'm also like sweating right now. Now the focus is on the buttocks. Push off with the feet and squeeze the buttocks and lift from the gluteals. Now press it out and move it, move it, move it. Swing it out. Where are these people now? I want to know where all five of these people are. Eight. Now pull it in a little tighter. Eight of these, four more. Pull. Now add the knees. Take it up. Lift it. Lift it. Take it behind again. Take it side. Two, three. Okay, I was talking shit, but this is actually kind of a good workout, especially if you need something kind of just like low paced. Like nothing crazy? Is this why everyone was really fit in the 80s? Or was it the drugs? I wonder if they thought this move alone was gonna give you like a tiny waist. This is part 100. Of my downstairs neighbors hating me. What is this do? I vote we all start working out to jazz music and music from the 80s again. This cool down got so serious. Like they're all so calm now. Big stretch, knees slightly bent, stretch to the side. Now the important thing here, fall out and shake it out. With all this talk about losing fat and dropping pounds, I just want to reinforce one crucial point. My emphasis here in this tape, as in all my videos, is to help you shift your focus from getting thin to getting healthy. So practice this fat burning workout three or four times a week and you'll not only lose weight, but you'll stay fit and you'll get the results you want. Great job. Right. I literally, I said that in the beginning of this video. I was like, I feel like she's using Bud's words, like I feel like she's just using like, get thin and like, fat burning. But she literally ended her video saying, let's get strong. Let's get healthy. Wow, she was a queen before her time. We love that. Kathy Smith, we officially stan. Okay, I'll admit it. I was talking a little bit of shit before the video started. I was like, this is gonna be one of those like lame 80s aerobic workouts. Like, I'm not gonna sweat. Like, this is gonna be boring. Um, I actually got my heart rate up. I'm actually sweating a little bit. Um, I think a little bit more than usual because my hair is down and I do have this thick headband on, but nonetheless. An actually decent workout. This is definitely something to try, especially if you need like a low impact, but you need to get your heart rate up. Maybe you're not interested in like lifting weights. Maybe you're not interested in like hit movements or jumping or intense squatting. This actually is a good workout for that. Moral of the story is that Miss Kathy Smith walked so all these YouTube, Instagram fitness influencers could run. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. As always, if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you being here. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. I love you so much and I'll see you in the next video. Time to take off this diaper. Thank you.